So I got a call this morning from a guy. He was searching online and found me on Google My Business. And I guess he looked at 1-800-GOT-JUNK but said they didn't have great reviews and sounded kind of expensive. Um, but he gave me a call and he said he had a truck shell to get rid of and some other stuff just lying around his shop. So I told him, well, check out my website for price range. Um, he did tell me that he had a couple of freezers and I let him know that freezers are pretty expensive to get rid of because of the refrigerant. So they cost me $43.75 a piece at the dump. He said, no problem. Um, he said, I don't mind paying. So anyways, he didn't sound like he was gonna be too cheap, which was nice. And um, we booked the job for 6 p.m. tonight. Now, I already had a bed frame in the back of my dump trailer, or uh, I guess, yeah, it is a bed frame. Um, it's like one of those little motorized bed, uh, inclined beds, uh, but it wasn't honestly that heavy and it was from my real estate broker, him and his wife, um, were getting rid of it. And so I just charged them a hundred bucks to pick it up cause they're friends of ours. And actually my real estate broker from back in the day, he married, he married my wife and I, but, um, anyway, so I did that for a hundred bucks and that was already in the trailer. And so I was happy to, you know, fill up the trailer, um, with this guy's load. He just had a bunch of odds and ends. Nothing was honestly super heavy. Even those freezers weren't bad. Had a bunch of miscellaneous wood scraps lying around. He had a wood shop. He's got, um, he actually fixes up chainsaws. Um, had a really cool shop. Very, very nice guy. Um, him and his wife were, were very sweet. And uh, he actually helped me load, as you can see. So that was cool. Made things go faster, but uh, didn't get in the way. Just kind of helped out with little stuff. and. I appreciated that. Um, he had really nice access. He parks his travel trailer on the side yard and so I was able to back up to where that normally is. He put it out on the street so I could be there. Looking pretty good. Filling up pretty nice here. We'll get the rest of it. Got a little bit of stuff on the wall here. This stuff here, over in the corner. Then we got truck shell we got to put on last. That's up there. Is that truck shell? We got a, some of this stuff. Mower. We'll keep on going on. Let's go right there. Yeah, just a bunch of miscellaneous stuff. Really, there was. You know, a lot of wood, some cardboard, like I mentioned, some boards, um, a couple of freezers. Um, gosh, what else? He had some siding, some old siding. We threw on some parts from old lawn mowers and an old lawn mower. Um, and then the biggest thing was the truck shell, but honestly, that wasn't that hard. And, uh, you know, we threw that on at the end, um, strapped that down. You'll see us pull the tarp down on it. And um, honestly, it was a pretty easy job. I was in and out of there in 45 minutes. He uh, I charged him $390 and then he gave me a $20 tip. So that was cool. Um, so anyways, 410 revenue from that, 100 from the other job, and uh, not a bad day.